Stalker United won. So what comes next in the Barclays Premier League? The league leaders, Tottenham Hotspur, host third-placed Arsenal. So what comes next in the Barclays Premier League? While well, second-placed Chelsea entertain 12th-placed Fulham. Fourth-placed Liverpool visit 13th-placed Swansea City. We should have a fine game for you today. I'm Martin Tyler, Alan Smith is with me. Welcome to you all. West Bromwich Albion in this game today against Sunderland. Sunderland will be watched close. He's got to be, and he's put it in for the goal. Used the maximum time in this first half and squeezed in a goal before the break. Yeah, they'll be pleased with that because I don't think they're showing the best form, but uh, it would have pleased the manager in that dressing room. And he just might be decisive. Let's see. Here's the shot. It's a goal on that level. Well, the shot actually has gone in, and that's taken us by surprise. Yeah, it has, but uh, when you see the part of the net it's finished in, the keeper couldn't do much about it. Well, we're back. Good ball. And the shot's off, and that's an excellent goal. They're in front now. There's nothing like one goal to give you the confidence for another, and that's just what's happened here. Well, a wonderful goal. When he gets the chance, he makes full use of that. Well, this was a match of fine margins. The final whistle has gone, and the final score is two. Ready and waiting for you now, the classified results from elsewhere. Thanks, Martin and Alan. The Barclays Premier League. Chelsea, four. Fulham, nil. Everton, two. Southampton, two. Manchester United, two. Reading, nil. Queen's Park Rangers, two. Manchester City, one. Stoke City, three. Wigan Athletic, one. Swansea City, nil. Liverpool, nil. West Bromwich Albion, one. Sunderland, two. So what do those results mean to the league table? At the top of the table remain Tottenham Hotspur with 33 points. In second, Chelsea with 32 points. In third, Liverpool with 20... So what comes next in the Barclays Premier League? The league leaders, Tottenham Hotspur, face a trip to 16th-placed Fulham, while second-placed Chelsea visit 19th-placed Leicester City. In third place, Liverpool host 7th-placed Manchester City. We should be in for a great match today. Martin Tyler here, along with Alan Smith, to describe the action for you. Yeah, hi there, Martin, and I'm hoping we're going to describe some really exciting action here. That's a good pass. Here he is with the chance. Here's the chance. He scored. People say that you just get lucky in the box, but I don't think that is the case. He knows where to move, when to move. Yeah, and in his ability, that is difficult to coach. I think it comes naturally to this. And we're coming towards the last whistle. Feguli. What a chance! They can have a crack here, and they pulled it back level. Small fry they might be, but they've had a big moment here, and they're level. Yeah, they've got great spirit within this team. They would not lie down, and uh, who knows now? Well, you have to hand it to him. What a lovely first... At a very important time of the game, but just, just off target. Just looking at his manager jumping up and down. He thought he'd... Well, let's get right up to date now with all the classified results. Thanks, Martin. Let's look ahead to the next round of fixtures of the FA Cup. And in the tie of the round, Aldershot Town entertain Carlisle United. While second-placed Juventus host second-placed Manchester United. While second-placed Hamburg entertain second-placed Inter. While second-placed Valencia host second-placed Bordeaux. Champions Cup, Aalborg 2, Schalke 1. So what comes next in the Barclays Premier League? The league leaders, Tottenham Hotspur, entertain 19th-placed Leicester City. While second-placed Chelsea host 14th-placed Aston Villa. In third place, Arsenal face a trip to 20th-placed West Bromwich Albion. 
fourth place Liverpool. Hello, everybody. I'm Martin Tyler. Alongside me, the familiar voice of Alan Smith. Yes, this should be a cracker today. Really looking forward to it. And today, it's Manchester City. In here. Gonna cross it. Well, he's only picked out an opponent with that cross. Shots on here. He scored! Well, they were patient in their build-up play, worked the ball, waited for the opening, created it and took it. Yeah, they just moved the ball across and they found the opening, they found the, they found the outlet, didn't they? And uh, boy, did he take his chance. And that's it, there goes the final whistle, and the final score is 1-0. Well, now it's time for the classified results. Thanks, Martin and Alan. The Barclays Premier League. Cardiff City 1, Reading 0. Chelsea 4, Aston Villa 1. Manchester City 1, Sunderland 0. Manchester United 3, Everton 0. Newcastle United 4, Southampton 0. Queen's Park Rangers 0, Liverpool 2. Stoke City 2, Fulham 1. Swansea City 3, Wigan Athletic 1. Tottenham Hotspur 2, Leicester City 1. West Bromwich Albion 2, Arsenal 1. Now let's see what effect that's had on the league standings. At the top of the table remain Tottenham Hotspur with 39 points. In second, Chelsea with 36 points. In third, Manchester United with 28 points. In fourth, Liverpool with 28 points. In fifth, Newcastle United with 27 points. In the last eight of this tournament, as these two teams have, it's a great compliment to both, but only one can go into the semi-final. Yeah. And here's the header. Oh, the bar's still shaking. And it's a headed effort at goal. It's goal with a brilliant header. He really climbed, got great power to it, and it raced into the back of the net. Oh, what a corner, what a well-worked corner that was. Everybody knew their place, they knew what they were doing. They came up perfectly. Well, we've waited. Try all right. This is, here's the shot. Yes. The equaliser. Well, there he is. That fox in that box, he scored again. And he's just got that nose for sniffing out the chance. Try all right. They both fight, and he takes the shot. This late, and that's great. It must be the winning goal. Sunderland's late scorer here has turned the place. It's gone mad here. Oh, he's made himself a hero, hasn't he? No, it's all about timing, isn't it? And what a moment that was to score. Can't see any way back now for the training team. Arsenal have gone behind. Well, that's the quarter-final over with. They're...